Huge Omnipod news just hit for Omnipod 5 updates and the upcoming Omnipod 6. Here's what you need to know. Inslet held an investor day where they laid out updates coming to Omnipod 5 and a bunch of other products coming in the next few years and beyond 2028. The current pump will get an enhanced algorithm with a lower target of 100 milligrams per deciliter down from 110. They also say the new algorithm will extend Potter's time in automation mode. Does this mean that there are new settings like temp basal extended bullets in automation mode? I don't know, what do you think in the comments? And in the first half of 2026, it will connect to all major CGMs, including Libre 3 Plus. Next up, we've got updates to Omnipod 6. So the new pod will come out in 2027. It will be the same form factor, but have some upgrades. One, it will have stronger Bluetooth connection, meaning you can wear your continuous glucose monitors and pump in a more flexible way. They won't have to be on the same side of your body. Love that. And the new pod will connect to all CGMs. No needing to worry about which pod you have. It will connect to anyone you want. Inslet says that by going down to one pod, this could speed up their innovation and their update rollouts by up to six to nine months. They also announced a new insights platform called Discover, where people who use the pump or healthcare providers can look at deep insights on the therapy. The Discover platform's already in limited market release in a few areas in the United States, and hopefully it will roll out wider soon. There were so many more announcements, including a fully closed loop algorithm for people with type two, and even announcements into beyond 2028 on what like an Omnipod 7 looks like. For more details on that, stay tuned for my video coming on YouTube on Friday. And we got into all of this and more on diabetic.info. Make sure you head over to that website and follow this page for more diabetes tech tips and news.